A familiar face and voice remembered this morning. The Chicago Cubs adding a tribute on the Wrigley Field marquee and tweeting, the Cubs mourn the passing of legendary Chicago radio personality and lifelong Cubs fan, Lynn Bramer, and friend to all of us on this desk right yeah. here. What an amazing guy. Yeah, he was uh, an amazing broadcaster, an amazing uh, person, an amazing friend. Uh, this one really hurts. The, this is a, a really tough one. WXRT, where Lynn Bramer became such a beloved radio friend to Chicago since he began there in 1984 and then on the air since 1991, paid tribute to him this morning. He died yesterday after a tough battle with prostate cancer. At 10 o'clock this morning, the cameras were assembled were asked to leave WXRT so Lynn's friends and co-workers could properly remember this giant in Chicago radio, his longtime friend Terry Hemmert, starting it off. We have come to pay tribute to our best friend in the whole world, Lynn Bramer, who passed yesterday morning with his uh, lovely wife and son, who we'll talk about later. But uh, what we're going to do is we're, we might lose it and we might be laughing our you-know-whats off because that Lynn would kick our you-know-whats if we didn't. And I just want to set it straight right here at the beginning that uh, listeners who met Lynn at a concert or something or at an XRT event or a benefit, he did a lot of those, or if they never met him and they just heard him on the radio and they're thinking... Was he really my best friend, or was that just shuck and jive? Well, he really was your best friend. I mean, he, he was the real deal. But I am joined here by Marty Lennertz, who just put in his first uh, shift, and now he's on another one. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's amazing when, when, when someone can touch so many lives. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and Lynn could do that. Yes. You know, we talk to people every day on the radio, but I don't know, there was something special with Lynn that was different than, than anyone I've ever heard. The tribute to uh, Lynn uh, continued uh, last July. He took himself off the air to undergo chemotherapy for the prostate cancer, but then returned to the air in November. Lynn Bramer has been connecting with fans on WXRT for years. He started the segment Lynn's Bin, where he would read essays on just about any topic. Those essays usually ended with, take nothing for granted, it's great to be alive. Lynn Bramer your best friend in the whole wide world was 68 years old. Now, in 2018 and 19, I went to the WXRT studios and talked with Lynn to get a preview of the Lollapaloozas that were about to kick off each of those years. He not only offered me some suggestions, but with his musical expertise, talked to me about what the music festival had evolved into. You know, every year uh, uh, they have artists that kind of belie the original Lollapalooza, which was kind of an alternative rock event. But uh, every year they bring something for everybody. So this year, for example, it's Bruno Mars. Uh, that's not my jam necessarily, but we'll bring in a whole new audience to Lollapalooza. People are very excited about that. Now a lot of XRT listeners will go to the other side of Lollapalooza to catch the national at the same time. So uh, I, I think there's an effort for them not to be too cool for the room. I even drifted over to the EDM stage because that's hilarious uh, for me. <laughs> I put on a great dancing uh, exhibition last year at the EDM. You know, everybody's dancing like crazy and jumping up and down, and I was standing there doing this. <laughs> Pretty impressed. Very, very, very impressed. Lynn Bramer, such a great guy. Uh, Chicago will miss him. I will miss him uh, tremendous. Such a dry you, wit. Right. You know, in addition to radio, he was a great philanthropist. I mean, that's how I actually met him, not through radio, was just doing fundraisers for various things. He was always out there helping people. Yeah. Uh, a, amazing guy. On, on and off the air. What you, what you heard yeah. on the radio is exactly what you got. Yeah. 